crews are already packing up the chopper. Damn, I thought I lived to see those two. But down. Most of these hired guns have no idea what's coming. I'll be the first to find out. down in Syria? Yeah, it was a bit of a mess. Croft? Constantine didn't expect to find her in there. She managed to bring the whole tube down on our heads. Thorn in his side, that one. Speaking of Croft, she's still out there. They still want her alive. Not anymore. She's too much trouble. They should have killed her when they had a chance. She was useful for a time. Let us hear, right? Think Trinity was trying to recruit her? It's not our place to speculate. Orders are clear. We see her, we shoot to kill. We stand now on the very cusp of a new world. The Divine Source has been located. Croft, while still alive, has been effectively neutralized. But Anna grows weaker by the hour. Her voice... That voice I've known my whole life... is starting to falter. I asked her if she remembers that night. The first night that God carved purpose into my hands. The night that he chose me. She said she did. 
And then she smiled and said that we would have nights again like that once this ordeal is over. For her, I stay strong. In the old city, we will find the divine source. I will save my sister, and together, we will save this world from itself. A pendant? No. A modern reliquary. There's a small human bone inside. Saint Peregrine. Patron of the terminally ill. A rifle shell, but there's something unusual about this one. Latin engraving on the end. Kill them all. God will know his own. I won't die in this godforsaken valley. My faith is strong. My will is strong. Even if my mind keeps wandering away. In our youth, Constantine and I in our youth, he, he was a difficult child. Always wondering, always questioning, afraid of what the future might hold. Afraid that he might never find his purpose. The night I cut those marks into his hands, the night I whispered into his ear, I made him. I saved him. He believed it to be the work of God, just as I'd hoped. Now I need him to save me. And if in the end he can't, then I'll save myself. Close this time. Figured when I find you, maybe I'll have learned something that'll help. Here's what I know. There's an operation here. Something big. Hundreds of nasty-looking soldiers, no insignia, no nothing. All holed up in this old Russian facility. Looks like it was once one of those awful gulag prisons. I came down here thinking you needed me, Lara, but Christ. How backwards is that? Before too long, I might be the one who needs rescuing. I hope the guides are still alive and can hear this. I'll stay out of sight as long as I can, but it's getting pretty damn cold out here. I'm gonna have to find some kind of shelter soon. Is becoming tiresome. Just give in to God's will! If you're 
Drona! Your loyalty to her is strong. I admire you. I do. But even my patience has limits. Tell me what you know. Now! Please, no. Don't listen to him! I was only doing what I believed was right. No! Uh. <laughs> Sweep the cell blocks. Kill everyone. I should have killed him, but he was unarmed. I just couldn't. Shh. You shouldn't have to. I am so sorry for getting you into this mess. <coughs> I thought I could keep up. They're coming. We're surrounded. This time I've got your back. He's dying. We don't have much time. Bar the door.
respond. We've got to deal with her. We're almost in position. Not seeing the target yet. Waiting for orders. Stay in position. Get ready. She's dangerous. Roger. I know that you like to read the archaeological journals now, but I urge you that if you see anything written which is less than pleasant about me, to ignore it. There are those who simply do not understand the work I'm doing here. Perhaps they're even frightened by it, but their fear and stupidity is not my concern, and neither should it be yours. I will explain everything in good time, my darling girl. The people that were frightened, were they Trinity? You never told me. I guess it doesn't matter now anyway. They found their way to me. Now I'm going to have to deal with them.